Now, the former president of Colombia, Juan Manuel Santos, was honored with the Nobel Peace Prize in 2016 for pursuing a deal to end what was described as the longest running war in Latin America. Now, Santos was awarded for brokering a deal to stop the fighting in the 50 year conflict with the revolutionary armed forces of Colombia, better known by its Spanish acronym FARC. Right after winning the Nobel Prize in 2016, Santos had spoken to Vion World as one's. Palki Sharma Upadhyaya sharing his struggle in bringing about peace in his country. Listen. Uh, you were awarded the Nobel Peace Prize in 2016. Describe for us your journey and your country's journey in, in achieving this peace deal. Well, it's a very um, difficult path, but very rewarding. We had an internal war for more than 50 years, 54 years. And ending a, a war of 54 years is difficult. Uh, leadership uh, to make war is easy. I had to make war when I was Minister of Defense. Mm -hmm. um, and leadership to make peace is much more difficult. You have to change uh, um, the prejudices, the sentiments of the people, the way uh, the people see each other. Uh, you have to teach people to forgive. And that is much more difficult. But uh, we uh, went through this path, uh, breaking uh, bottlenecks and, uh, and uh, breaking obstacles. And we finally approached something that in Colombia eight years ago would seem impossible. We made, and I am proud to say, the impossible possible. We are now uh, living in peace. This is a new country. Uh, you go to many areas in Colombia that you had never been before because the war had not allowed that, security situation did not allow it, and now we're Colombians are rediscovering and the world is rediscovering a new Colombia. Right. Many countries in this, the world in, in today's day and age are struggling with what Colombia struggled with, and there are stalemates, and there are negotiations which go nowhere. What are the lessons they can learn, including India, from your peace deal? Well, first, that there is no conflict that is impossible to overcome uh, through dialogue, through understanding, uh, and through perseverance. Uh, every conflict, conflict should uh, be solved. People here in Colombia never thought eight years ago that what we did was possible. If you, the Poles said, uh, don't even try. This is impossible. Now we are living in a new world, in a new country. Uh, I think that you must uh, uh, create the conditions. Every conflict has its own particular conditions. In our case, uh, we needed to have the support of the region. We slowly but surely got that support. The international community, we got that support. The United Nations, the Security Council, we got that support. Um, we, through conversations, uh, won the confidence, the trust of your counterpart. This is one of the very uh, most difficult aspects of any negotiation. Uh, that we, after some years, we were able to build that uh, minimum trust necessary to reach agreements and then uh, be realistic. Uh, uh, if both parts are, are realistic and accepting, the position of the others, then solutions are, are possible.